decide like, what to do here. Uh, let's take Revive off. Uh oh, hey everybody. So, yeah, we, are... we are live. <laughs> there we go. I feel like <laughs> I... <laughs> And I and I feel like I'm roboting. Nah, maybe not. That's okay. No, no. you're good. No, 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 you're I know good. the cameras are, the cameras are screwed up though. So hold on one second. Let me just see if I can fix that. Oh, they okay. should still be good. Yeah, they're there. They're good. All right, there we go. So uh, welcome everybody. Uh, Thursday night, as always, we are back for the 201, and we are playing Pantheon. Uh, and uh, we have a uh, group together tonight. We have a. a a regular group, but for one sub in uh, because Sparrow couldn't be here. But um, if you're new here, welcome. We are Static Group Live. We play MMOs and group centered games and have fun doing things as a group. And uh, tonight we've got uh, we've got my crew, uh, myself. My name is Theric, and I am playing the rogue. Well, one of the rogues. We have a, we have an, a, an additional rogue in our group tonight. That is my friend <laughs> Fate, <laughs> uh, aka oh, Tyrion in game. Hi, Fate. How are you doing? How's it going? Doing good, doing good. Awesome, awesome. So, uh, yeah, and then our tank is Mr. Stans in the fire. He stands. Evening all. And Mr. Leech of Rohan here will be doing the healing duties tonight. Uh, the lone healer tonight. Are you feeling the, the pressure? The extra yep. healing. See, that's why I needed to get to 10. Yeah. I just needed to really come through for everyone. That's, that's why. Yeah, you're up at level 10 oh, well. cleric spells. Yeah. Yeah, there's no excuse tonight. That's why you're up at the manor earlier because you're prepping to keep us alive. I need, I need it. I needed it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and Crow Singer is here on the Enchanter. Hi, Crow. I am going to enchant tonight. <laughs> you're always so enchanting. <laughs> All right. I, so Gulo gave me this this fancy armor, so I'm looking good. Yeah, definitely. It's a good looking robe. Whoops. Ah, finally running. Um, yeah, so like I said, we're going to head to the spider cave. If uh, that uh, gets too boring, we're going to go up and uh, hit some wildlife up on the ledge. And like this ridgeback bear that's staring us down at the camp here. But um, I say let's yep. go. Are you guys ready? All right, let's do it. Let's go. Yeah. I'm going to follow stands. Okay. Uh, there's your first mistake. <laughs> mm-hmm. I should have asked this before, but everyone have food? And drink? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yep. I do. And just Thanks in, for the reminder to actually eat. In terms of levels, so Manorohan, you're 10. I think everybody else, what are, what are your levels? I'm 8. Does. 9 here. 8. Yeah. Yeah. And eight. I'm, I'm 8 as well. So. And Fate, you're, I think you're, you said you were 6.5 last time we talked, right? Yeah, actually, I, I was a little more than that. I'm 6 and 3 quarters. So I'll be 7 pretty soon. Six nice. and three yeah, quarters. It'll go pretty fast down here. Oh, there's a group party here. Oh. So oh. May maybe we'll get in the wildlife in sooner than we thought. Hey, Joe. We can, check, um, the, we can check the other side. Mm -hmm. the side. Just kind of be careful of the hole. Yeah, the <clears throat> the getting caught on. Yeah, I see like people over here. here as well. Well, I yeah. see two people oh, over well. here. <laughs> well. I, I don't know if they're, they're pulling. Hmm. Uh, if it's less two people... Probably not. They're not even near the entrance, so. Yeah, yeah. It doesn't look like so they're. They count. Oh, but this is this is totally empty in here. Oh, so oh the other group is pulling the entire cave. Oh, yep. Wow. Yeah. There's... Okay. I see one. Oh. Uh, I see oh. a death weaver right there. Yeah, yeah. Coming after you. Come not after me. It's that's going after the guy that just came out. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, let's yeah. head up to the ridge oh. and do some oh, wildlife hunting. Sure. Sounds good. Mm -hmm. Plenty of plenty of folks to take. Little. A hobgoblin okay. here or there. Yeah, yeah, I like those hobgoblins we up there. We could also do the goblins. Well, it might be a little. No, I would probably have a good level for it. The goblins up by the Western Overlook, up by the uh, the Griffins as well. It's also a good camp for that. Mm, yeah. Okay. Wait. Yeah. What, when did I lose the speed buff? I lost mine too. I I lost mine too. I think Vin. Uh... Took it off. Switched it off. Maybe, uh, maybe he was buffing some someone else. One thing Vin showed us last night was, with his pet, if he can target or someone else can target a mob. So he had uh, Zip sneak into the cave, target something deeper in the <laughs> yep, cave. Yeah. He would target Zip's target. And then he would send in his pet, and he just has to send him in, and then he can and at any. It figures point, it out, yeah. He paths all the way back, 
So really? he was pulling for us. Yeah, it was Quick crazy. Quick reminder to not walk on the rocks. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That is crazy. Oh, yeah. So that seems like a pretty good pulling <laughs> strategy to send your pet in. Yeah. And... Well, the, the downside is that it's the same as a regular player pulling, though. There's no, like, like ag aggro-wise, it could totally pull everything. social pull everything yeah. in the, you know, as well. Yeah. So. Well, uh, you have to be careful with it, but it is true. really neat to me that it, it just kind of navigates all the way in. Mm -hmm. Like, you don't even need... Well, and Vin was saying, though, that um, if it's an animal or if it's a creature, then it's a single... He can do single pull every time. Is that right? If it's an animal or a creature, saying, you can so single I, pull it. Yeah. Huh. And nothing else will aggro because the wolf is a creature, maybe, and that's there. Yeah. Wow, that's interesting. Interesting. I, I don't know if that's a... Uh, unintended or intended but oh. i mean who knows so this hobgoblin over here is yellow to me this is good there's a boar yep. these are orange we're, we're looking good fellas we're, we're looking good this hobgoblin is our first uh, victim yeah. yes sir there you go gotta remember how to play the rogue <laughs> what am i doing here <laughs> too many games too many games. oh uh pressure plate oh back up i didn't yeah, i didn't even attack <laughs> It almost killed yeah, me. We're, we're we're a full group fighting, you know, solos, so it's yeah, it shouldn't be too scary, too bad. Okay. Large ash tree, though. So uh, I'm at four <laughs> bubbles. Let's see how the let's see how the experience rate is. What kind of tree? That's one large ash tree. It's a large ash tree. This is a dark orange. Yeah. Oh, we got oh. boar too. Okay. Oh, and Des is down. Not the boar. Thank you. Good job, Crow. Hmm? Yes, for the chance. I love Arc of Light oh so much. It's a cool spell, yeah. What is Arc of Light? Yeah, what is Arc I'll of Light? I'll admit it, it makes me jealous. Oh. Uh, I just got it. So it is. it restores the health of an ally, yes, but after the heal occurs on, on whoever you have targeted, it jumps to the most injured member within 20 meters, and it jumps up to two times. It's chain heal. It's awesome. Oh, okay. Yeah. So it goes from the one you're targeting to what's the criteria for the next target, or is it just random? The next, uh, within 20 meters, the next injured, or most injured. Most injured. Oh, okay. So yeah. it's pretty efficient. Yeah. It's not just randomly popping onto a group member that may not need it. That's pretty cool. And And is it expensive? Like, is it big cooldown like what's uh the... it's it, it's it's only, only 10 seconds but it's 25 mana and my my big heal right now my normal big heal is eight mana so it is pretty expensive hmm. so <clears throat> oh hey whoever the pantheon rise of the fallen <laughs> youtube account controller is probably fire it's, it's gotta be fire yeah. fire is everywhere yep. yeah how's it okay, going this man? might be too thanks for stopping by it's our regular thursday night pantheon stream killing hobgoblins and bears oh my oh my Doesn't fit in the song very well. <laughs> oh, and the pressure plate, yeah. I didn't <laughs> I even see it. He was almost dead. In the back. Good idea. Mm -hmm. If I had a bow, I would stay at the back. I don't have a bow. There's no bows. Fire, when are we getting bows? You'd still get eaten by pressure plate. <laughs> Even if I hit it with a bow from a distance, it doesn't. It's not uh, range. If it's a, I mean, if it's a damage reflect. Hmm. That doesn't seem right. But I guess. It's Otherwise, yes, it reflects spells as well. Yeah. And dots. Oh, and does everything. it? Oh, okay. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. It's a, yeah. It's extremely nasty to wizards. I thought it was only um, melee. It would make sense, right? Because it's pressure plate armor. Hmm. Yeah, the name is a little weird for what it does. Yeah, the name's weird, but again, 
enough games already screw over melee as it is. Let's <laughs> not encourage <laughs> further. <laughs> All right, that's uh, that's it. On to wildlife. <laughs> ben would never use emojis. I'm gonna screenshot that fire. You're gonna get in trouble from Ben. Uh, he he is he is of a proper vintage to use emojis. I'm sure. <laughs> Vintage. What kind of barrels do you think he he aged in? Oak, cherry, <laughs> maple. He's Canadian. <laughs> Did you guys see that heel shoot from people? Man, that was fun. I didn't see it. Yep. I gotta, tell me when you're gonna do it. I'm gonna watch for yeah, it. Yeah, I'll, I'll tell you when to do it again. It's like, you see a little thing of light shoot across. It's fun. And it's new, and so it's exciting. It's like a new new car. Ooh, look at this. <laughs> Remember to always cast it on, on stands because I bet he'll never break the chain. <laughs> never break the chain. Hey, come on. <laughs> it was bound to happen. <laughs> I mean, that's what I was going for. I was hoping somebody would start seeing. Good. There's a good chance, no matter what stream you're on or who you're playing with, somebody will start singing. Mm -hmm. I've got stands and Man of Rohan in, in here, you know. Yeah, and dead, yeah so. it's almost a guarantee. <laughs> I can guarantee you I won't start singing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you'll, you'll just do the lyrics. Wow. You're like the, the teleprompter, and then somebody else sings. <laughs> the teleprompter. <laughs> Proper we'll vintage. Some weird times in my he's, time. He's like Shatner. Shows. He'll just do the spoken word version. <laughs> yeah, that's right. I don't think proper vintage is shade. I'm a, I'm a big fan of things that are vintage. All right. I myself am vintage. No, Theric, we're not vintage. We're old. <laughs> don't don't give me your don't give me your reality. I saw something online this week where somebody was saying that. He said, I wasn't prepared for the day I realized that I was older than my doctor for the first time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, that kind of sucks. <laughs> I had that today. I, I went to a physiotherapy appointment today, and the doctor was definitely in his 30s. Like, man. I had a doctor recently that uh, I'm just really glad he was male. <laughs> you know, <laughs> oh, I don't. I think we got the preview of this appointment last time, Metaroyan, and, and uh -huh. uh, I feel like uh, yeah, I'm happy about that. I'm glad it's done and over with. I'd imagine. <laughs> this is a tougher born. Uh, tough enough. Yeah, he was born for Good. battle. Born <laughs> for battle. Dark Horn. Now is he gonna rush? Oh yeah, he got stance. Depends on when he when stance gets aggro. Yeah. And also, I, I can take the I rush him, though. It also depends on if I let him get the uh, range he wants to do it, or if I just mess with the boar. <laughs> because you you can actually just range dance the boars and they get annoyed with you and uh, really then don't charge. Yep. Really? Oh jeez. Funny. What? Am I, why am I not fighting? Whoops. Are you? Are you mining? Um. No. <laughs> yes. I was right here. Always. Any? Whenever you're looking for him, where's our healer? He's, and you know, especially oh. tonight because Pharaoh's not here, Man Yeah, I, I've got a <laughs> on, on task. I can't. Uh, be distracted by this is an intervention you have a problem i told Sparrow that specifically. sweet sweet yeah, sweet or <laughs> how are we feeling about season so far be honest no hard feelings that's a good round table question let's let's go around the room I'll, i mean i'll talk about it first and i have to say i am um, i am looking forward to season two because i found the the space that we could um 
the, the content that was available in Avengers Pass for season one was a little underwhelming to me personally. And um, the issue with the Gadai camps where the, some of them are sort of standing around and that kind of thing. I know that you I know that you guys have been working on it and it's uh, uh, something that you're aware of and, and it's going to be fixed. But I was just a little bit, just because it was the first season, I think I was maybe, um, I didn't know what my, the expectation should be. I think maybe my expectations weren't set appropriately. So, um, but you know, then going in and seeing Demeth Village and all the, the NPCs there was nice. But again, same thing when there was no, um, you know, dialogue, there was no sort of implementation of any, you know, they're just, they're just basically mannequins. Um, so that, that was, you know, the good and the bad, I would say, um, for me, what about you? What about you guys? Des? <laughs> I mean, Des. <laughs> I, I just, not you, Des. Throw him the ball. <laughs> uh, well, I mean, I, first week was rough. Uh, I, I think, you know, but at the same time, I was kind of expecting the growing pains for, you know, first time jumping into this like cadence. Um, but after that, I found myself actually wanting to log in. <laughs> I know that's not like super high praise, but um, I've played more in this season than I have uh, probably over the span of time that I've been testing. Um, and I was kind of, uh, I think I was talking about this, but I was a little uh, burnt out at, um, before season one. I didn't play much after December's test, um, just because there wasn't really much I was really excited for. Um, Not much had changed since yeah. 247. Exactly, right? exactly. Yeah. So uh, I think for me, I, I am definitely more looking forward to season two than I am uh, enjoying season one. I, I think also, yeah, AVP, with the between the problems and just like the it's kind of just a bunch of pretty like simple camps you know so it's, it's mm -hmm. it feels more like an extension of throne fast than it does avp right now okay. um so I, I kind of feel that but at the same time um i just like to see the world growing somehow <laughs> i mm -hmm. guess so i i'm a little bit of both a little bit of both well, that's fair. What about you, Crow? And have you played like outside of the Thursday nights? Have you done much? Not much, no. But on Thursdays, I really have a good time. Um, I don't know. There's a lot of work to be done, but it seems like the the pace is pretty good right now. Yeah, that's fair. Uh, Manor Rohan, what about you? Season one in? Yeah, I've got, and I'm I'm new. So uh, in regards to. I think I upgraded right at the beginning of the year, which I felt like this was a good time to start because of things happening. This, I think that was even before seasons were announced, but um, yeah, it was. Um, but I've got a couple things. One of them is um, uh, it was hard to deal. It's hard to deal with in AVP, at least all the broken camps and the Gadai especially. Just, yeah. You know, yeah, that's like a letdown. Yeah. So I'm like, man, it'd be great to, you know, break to, to, you know, to break. do this content, <laughs> <laughs> right. right? I'd love to kill these people. I I really am bloodthirsty, and and I, I, couldn't, <laughs> I couldn't slake that thirst. Bloodthirsty and... for or. <laughs> for, for or there you go. Or children. But, right. Or children. I was gonna say that. Yeah, you can't if there get were blood children, out of a stone though. <laughs> if I couldn't uh, kill children, yeah, if there were children here and I couldn't kill them, I'd be really. Oh, <laughs> Yeah. Well, yep. YouTube. No. No, I'm sorry, YouTube. There it is. Uh, no. YouTube uh, doesn't Fake care. children, virtual no, I game I children, <laughs> not real children. I love kids. Yep. My own especially. Okay. YouTube only cares um, if we start singing a song that it picks up and content matches. Otherwise, we can say yeah, anything we want. Yeah. <laughs> right. But I have really liked um, the uh, split up. So, you know, the four weeks and then two weeks and one week. Because yes, then you yes. get a new infusion of people being like, oh my goodness, look at this, and, and streaming, and it's really kind of a good, uh, someone said cadence, and it's a good cadence of new people coming in. And I, I think that just makes, especially the people who are only able to play for a couple weeks or a week, um, having, they'll have a lot more fun um, and, and excitement going into the next season. I think the there's a little more... 
I don't know, bittersweet stuff going on with with VIPs, you know, for um, right, right, the the things, you know, all the things that are being decided. Like, hey, I wish we could do this. Well, you know, oh, whatever, you know, is what I what I say in my head. But I'm only level ten, so <laughs> what right, do I care? Right, you know. But uh, it's been overall, I I think it's been a success. Uh, there's just some things that I would like to be a little more full yeah. at this point. Yeah. So that's fair. Yeah. What about yeah. you, Fate? What are your thoughts on season one? Um, initially, I was I was pretty disappointed because um, just uh, Avondir itself just there was Demoth is cool, but there just wasn't a lot to Avondir, um, <clears throat> at least with the the chunks we can access. Um, and so I'll, I'll be honest, like, I haven't really been playing this season um, because I, I really wasn't looking forward to doing the, the grind yet again. Yeah. Um, to, to get the grind to get up to, to Manor and then just to discover that there's there's really, the, Joppa talked about this, there's a big content gap between um, like 10 and 15, basically, <clears throat> where your like, only option is to just sit there at Manor and grind and grind and grind until you can do fort or something else. Um, but you did mention at least that there should, that should be alleviated a little bit in Mad Run. Yeah. Um, so we'll see, hopefully. Yeah. And stands, last but not least, <laughs> certainly not least, I'm sure you have plenty of opinions about season one. What are your thoughts? Me have opinions no. about games. <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about. Hey, this isn't March Madness RPG bracket. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure that uh, <laughs> you can tone it down a little bit for the MMO, right? No. <laughs> Grats on level somebody there. Yeah. Is that Thank you. Oh, <laughs> uh, So I suppose also the question uh, depends on how it was phrased or how we were answering it. Because the question was, how do we feel about seasons, not season one? Oh. Um. <laughs> Just as far as it was actually, as far as it was actually asked, so it's potentially two Love different you, questions. Man. <laughs> um, as far as seasons themselves, I think it is a very positive step towards, as everybody else has said, a cadence of development and content being put out. Um, it gives us something to actually expect, at least as a framework, for what's going to, what's going to be coming. Um, so I think that that is positive. Season one, like everybody else has said, has been a really mixed bag. It's more positive than um, it was a year ago. <laughs> I mean, there's there's no way around that that I think a lot of us had largely stopped testing the game in a lot of phases up until end of last year. And that was kind of the stuff that led into life tap, um, into us getting seasons here. So that has been a big, a big positive. But season one specifically has been kind of like, okay, oh, this is about. this is an appetizer. Ooh. Oh, yeah. I'm sure that group wants wants mm. us. I don't think. We I don't think we could do Bitterbone. No, it's it's red to me. I don't know what it red looks like to, to you. Me. Yeah. yeah. That's too bad. Yeah, I think he's level 16. Oh, I yeah. think. He'll wipe, yeah. he'll wipe us out. <laughs> Can't do that. Hey, Feasty, how's it going, man? I haven't seen you around in a while. Oh, in a while. So I'd like to revise my answer. <laughs> uh -huh. I, I think, do we all need to revise our answer? I mean, I'm going to be, yeah. I'm going to, Stans is being, is being super I, like, you know, I look at the question now and I see what you're saying. You didn't ask specifically about season one. He said, how about seasons so far? I mean, the only yeah. season we've had so far is season one. So that's yeah, yeah. So there, that's there's my defense. The, there's co seasons conceptually <laughs> and there's what we have in season one currently. Because and it, it, it's funny because I read it how Stan's read it. And then you guys all started talking about season one and I just completely forgot that that's like, <laughs> like oh, seasons in, in general. Um, I'm taking a way to see, wait and see approach still. Um, be, uh, because it's like it'll be nice to see you guys hit some deadlines um, but uh, like the you guys have to like keep hitting them mm -hmm. um, and yeah, so I'm a little to, leery to see project yeah every time. and so I'm a little leery about like the team's ability to continue to hit uh, like new content deadlines every six months mm -hmm. or not six months six weeks um, uh, without big breaks between the chapters. Yeah. 
Yeah. Hey, Drac. Yeah. Something that, um, I mean, it just in general, from, okay, so if we're answering the question from like seasons a, as a concept and uh, an idea and a, and a way of going about it, then I'll say this. I mean, something that you referred to at Manor Rohan that's gone on in the community sort of this week and this past week has been one of my lingering concerns about this kind of an approach. And that is that um, what's, what is it? Are we testing or are we actually in a live game service? Like technically we're testing, of course, mm. but people are treating it like a live game service because they're kind of treating it like a live game service. And you saw... Gotham himself has said multiple times that like he wants us to be playing. Mm -hmm. So you saw that this week. People are treating it like that. Right. And when, when they made some decisions this week, people usual. got up in arms about it. And it's like, well, I can understand why they're up in arms because the kind of like, the idea is, you know, play the game, but and, and in, 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 a, in a live MMO, character, you know, wipes and rollbacks are sort of like the worst case scenario right you just never really hard to recover from that yeah that's um obviously a thing but i mean i'm glad we haven't oh i got two oh is I that guy that always pressure plates up so leave the drag alone for a minute did i get did every one of them no but she got him oh got it yeah. Pressure plates. Oh, oh. It, it is up. I was not listening. It's not anymore, but yeah, oh, it, it's off. I will kill There's myself on, on that, that pressure one. plate in like two seconds flat. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's, it's harsh. Bad. I know. I'm, I have to stay away. I just come in for the final blow there, and that was all I could do. Yeah, no problem. Fire. Wind up. Wind up. Oh. <laughs> down goes Des. <laughs> I, uh, I, I tried to dodge it, but I ran out of cheese. <laughs> I, I was like, oh, I'll just dodge this. Then it was grayed out. And I was like, oh, no. Nope. <laughs> yeah, sorry for turning the question all analytical there. <laughs> no, man, that's, that's, Ooh, that's, that's all good. That's, that's your job, stance. <laughs> I enjoy stunning runaways. Does anyone still need six slot bags? Six slot bags? Uh, I hope not. No. If you do, I will get you better bags. No, I'm I'm good. Well, only for bank use. I have two empty um thingies. Two empty bag bags. bags. <clears throat> yeah. Oh. Really? Oh. oh my gosh. I will solve that. Somebody is yep. uh, tearing his trading with me. Fire. I'm just gonna welcome. add this boar out yeah, here. As long as it's fire. <laughs> welcome for the feedback. Now I have one empty bag slot. Yeah, for Rizal. Nah, wouldn't, wouldn't answer hit that guy's question. <laughs> Man, so much, uh, so much shade <laughs> at him uh, recently. Oh, oh grats. grats. Fate. Yep. Level 7. Although, that's... he's not Rizal anymore. He's Ulmo. Ulmo, yeah. What? Ooh, I like him even more. Why is he Ulmo? Ulmo? What the heck is that? Um, he mentioned just something about Rizal being like taken or something like that, so he changed his name. And I guess he goes by Ulmo in game anyway, oh. so he changed his Discord name. Well, Ulmo is the uh, the god of um, of the waves, basically of all the of dangerous parts. The yeah, he's a Vala. Yeah. Oh, from Lord of the Rings. Yeah. yeah. Oh, wow, oh. didn't know that. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Ruin's right? like, oh. <laughs> oh, I like him even more. <laughs> I mean, he is dangerous. Look, look at the crew we have in here tonight. You think there's not going to be Lord of the Rings references? <laughs> right. <laughs> How many of us have read Silmarillion? I've read about a third of it. I have I not. read it twice. I have not I've, read Silmarillion. I've read it. Define oh, red. <laughs> <laughs> Define red. <laughs> yeah, you can say that for a lot of things. It's like, how does the first 30 pages count? <laughs> Oh, no. Referenced and perused? Sure. No, no, you don't. I've, I've read it four or five times, but I bet you that Krill remembers more about it than I do. More about the details of it than I do. So I, I found it to be about as enticing as reading a um, history book. Mm -hmm. Oh, I, I, I really like it. Like a and history it's actually textbook. Really nice to listen to. Yeah. 
There's did some I just really... walk by a bear, or did that just spawn? Oh, that just yeah, spawned. I just spawned. happened to enjoy well, my history oh, okay. textbooks sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, watch this. Watch this, Derek. So does my dad, him. so... Oh, yeah, cool. Nice. More VFX coming in season two. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we should, is that when we'll get the um, some of the like class specific like some of the stuff that uh, Code's been working on? Yeah. Um, some of his stuff is already in, mm -hmm. uh, but I can't remember which spells are are his. But I'm frankly most excited for the audio update mm -hmm. for season yeah. two because yeah. I know that's audio and light. There's just so much. Yes, the light coming in. Oh, Sound do we want to light. talk about the 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 lighting that Joppa was talking about in the Q and A? Yeah, yeah. What do you have to say? <laughs> Go for it. I'm a little I'm a little leery because he he says he's gonna make it easier to see, but then he's also taking away almost all of the light sources except for torches. Hmm. Um, Interesting. Well, I yeah. mean, when they said it was too dark, I mean, I heard him say it was too dark. And I think yeah, that probably people are like, yes, <laughs> it's too dark sometimes. But then, I mean, don't go too crazy so, on that, right? Yeah, visually, I'm curious as to see how that will turn out. <clears throat> um, and I'm, I'm all for the mechanics because they, they were talking about the mechanics of like, uh, you can't target things in the dark and stuff like that. I'm all for the mechanics if that works both ways, um, where like enemies also like in the dark also have a more difficult time like seeing you and like detecting you and stuff like that. Some, yeah, some animals on... can see really well in the dark. And... Yeah, yeah, like oh, yeah. they we've already seen that uh, mobs do have smell. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. So and like hearing. somehow can smell me. <laughs> if if that is translated um, so that you know certain mob types are more sensitive to smell versus sight mm -hmm. and then you just have to kind of figure out like oh well you know, I can hide from like humanoids, but I can't hide from you know, bears. Wolves. <laughs> like, just, yeah, wolves. It's just my fear is that it'll end up being that like it's still really dark and difficult to see, and he's taking away our light sources. Yeah. And yeah. also, we can't even target well, things in the dark on top of that. For now, he did make it clear that we're only going to torches for now. Yeah. How long is for um, now? That's, I mean, who knows? As long as it's, as uh, long as it's soon, it takes to get it, <laughs> so the torch feels good. When is now imminent? <laughs> soon. Like. Okay, are you guys seriously leaving all these bodies again? Uh, I feel like I've been uh, looting everything. I'm trying to slow no. down on my looting, but I mean, I'll loot I, the bear I just, meat. I, I can I, use I the bear meat. I just ran back to that. That was, yeah, just yeah, loot like crazy. We need we're, to, we're we need sorry, the looting Desiree. settings to be in. So. The what settings, crap? Yeah, that, that was brought up recently. Any kind of looting settings. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Just a matter of uh, prioritize, priori blah, 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 prioritizing Priority, it for Steve. Mm. I think they talked about that in the Q&A. And the what now does? The Q&A? <laughs> Q&A? Q &A. Prioritizing the Q&A. Hey, you know what the best part of the uh, Q&A was? The uh, Flaro. Is a, I'm a big fan of Flaros. Yeah, the Flaro, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was fun. I would like to request something with not just the nameplates, but also the buff icons having a background Gosh. to them so that you can see their duration and not have, oh, to rotate yeah. your, not have to rotate your camera periodically to get them into something dark. Yeah. Or at least uh, maybe not yeah. a bright yellow text. Yeah. Yeah. At the very least. Bright yellow is hard to see. Or like like, my, like a black with a white back shadow, a, a drop shadow. Yeah. My devourers, I have to watch out for when I need to reapply them and make sure that I have the essence to do so. And it's kind of a pain. Well, we or are, it could uh, be like Dez's Dire Lord buddy the other day and just not have them. Who here has attacks <laughs> that would be classified as magical? Not me. Um, uh, her name is Crow Seer. <laughs> that's what I thought. I think that's pretty or much Crow it. Crow Chanter. Yeah. 
Just you. Weapon damage, weapon damage, weapon damage. Um, I, I have yeah. magical attacks when I attack, but I'm mostly... Saving mana. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I, I have boil blood and life tap, but I don't use them as, as attacks so much as I use them as a source of threat. Yeah. Gotta use conviction. Yeah, better. and they've talked about just not having staff for for UI updates. It's understandable. Yeah. I'd rather I'd rather deal with kind of just functionality now, and then you know maybe later they can afford to have someone that is more specialized in UI and like get it really nice. Functionality. I do think UI is super important. New areas is definitely top of the list. We've got. Well, guys, I UI. I let the cat out of the bag today. Um, it's true that I am the person who created all of the art for the spells. No one else is claiming it. <laughs> really? So, is that right? No one else can prove that I didn't do it, so I'm going to claim it. When you it. said you wow. icons or all effects? The, the, uh, not the effects, the little icons. It's all me, okay, guys. Well, I recognize some, a uh, couple of them here from the Unity Asset <laughs> stores. So you're wrong. Yeah. <laughs> Are you sure they found that they people found these in like a pack of like 4,000 uh, icons on Unity. I, I actually have yeah. that pack. I'm still using it in Unreal. <laughs> yeah, Fire mentioned in chat there, uh, they have a video that's set for, pre I think it's premiering tomorrow, right you said? Tomorrow's video? Yeah, it'll show yeah. a lot more season two. More, most spell effects are coming in season three though, so oh. you may have to wait for another okay. season. Okay, can, I, can I be salty? At, at fire and 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 give them a hard time because can we stop what you? is seasons <laughs> what it let's phrase that out what is seasons <laughs> seasons in the sun seasons in uh, the abyss what are seasons what are seasons How are is seasons? one thing seasoning <laughs> Is like what is the is, I know Dez's is Dez's season is salt. His seasoning is salt right Dez, now. You're running away from a bear, buddy. <laughs> really? Yeah, he's right here. I don't see any bears. I got him. Oh. What right the, here. Oh my gosh. Okay. You were too focused on your grammar. <laughs> he was still pondering seasons. Well, something I mean, really important. I'm just saying. Not not to mention. It sounds like if it is about season two, I, I would have thought it would have, you know, season two or something like that in, in the in the title. But I'm like, wait, we already did a season. We should already know what seasons are. <laughs> I'm, I'm just, you know, when I watch it, I'll probably be like, oh, that's great. But I <laughs> fire. Can I also I... have the issues that season two is not, in fact, titled season two electric boogaloo. <laughs> it should be. True. Yes. I thought Mouth of Madness it's, it's is just Spider funny. Boogaloo. Spider. Which was far better than the original break in, by the way. <laughs> okay, okay Mero, I, I got it. He says it's not only a video for season two, so that's good. How long is it, Fire? Is it a little longer than the last one? I found the so the the last video was, was kinda neat, but as a premiere it was weird because it was like it felt like it was only a couple minutes long and um you know, like I don't having when we do the rewind, we use premieres, and I like premieres, but I find that they're very good for like long form conversation. Yeah, like you want people while to chat you're it going out. through. So I just wonder, you know, maybe if that's uh, what the reasoning for that was, or what the sort of thinking is there. Okay, it's around two minutes long. Okay, perfect amount. Oh, getting experience. I've gotten two, almost two and a half bubbles. I'm in my last bubble of before nine. Nice. I I will praise just the more content, more volume of of uh, videos and stuff. It's nice, but but I think I'm with you, Theric. It's like if if it's not just about season two, if it's like an you know more of a general seasons thing it's like seems like something we probably should have got when we were starting seasons uh which we kind of did we did get a, a seasons explainer yeah so then it's like you know what's this so probably because the supporters have now had their 
week or they're they're having their week or whatever right now mm -hmm. um you know there's probably gonna be a lot of word of mouth going around from people that got in for the first time and are telling other people like hey it's kind of cool and then they you know they go and check it out and they're like what what is this whole season of reference thing? Nice. yeah so like a reference point for for new eyeballs but yeah that makes sense Ooh. still it's what are seasons what are, what are seasons my my pet peeve is a little different i think What's your pet peeve? You know, you've got chapters is the big thing, and seasons is part of chapters. Oh, determined. I, yeah. I kind of think seasons should be the name of the big thing. It's reversed. It's more, like, more like book and chapter. Mm. But I mean, we're mixing season. our taxonomy with what we're doing. Taxonomies. Taxonomy. Yep, taxonomies. There's a vengeful spirit over there that's red. <laughs> Placeholder. Mm -hmm. yeah, it's Biddle Bro. Is that for Biddle Bone? Or... No, he's orange here. Yeah. Yep. A uh, vengeful spirit will probably wreck oh, us though because they speed us. cast. Yeah. Uh, bear. Oh, it's just dark blue. Can we? Blue. Um, I wonder if we should go check on the spider camp. No, we can run back down. Right. Over here. That's a good idea. So we, we are kind of killing the entire plateau, plateau about as fast as we were looking spot. for a, a tank earlier. Do it. Do a camp check. Do. Somebody do an OOC well, camp check. <laughs> <laughs> That's fair fire. With the recent stuff, no one's even going to say they're like, "Nope, I'm not saying we're a camp. We're just going to be here." <laughs> Come down and find oh, out. All we could have done is maybe memorized a name of one of those people and whispered, "Are you still at that camp?" That would that would require effort, Crow. I know, I know. That was I, far more effort than I'm willing to put in. I'm not at my best right now. <laughs> Chang says yes. Well, oh. I say Chang's lying, and let's go take it over. All caps, Chang says yes. Chang is going down. <laughs> PvP mode. Train him if you don't like him. <laughs> Hang him if you don't like him. Is that what you say? That's, that's a Ben Dean that's quote. That's what Ben said. No, <laughs> Chang him is what I thought. Oh, Chang him if you don't Dan like him. Chang him if you don't like him. <laughs> Well, at least my own joke is funny. Gracious. Yeah. We're not going uh, community here, Manor Rohan. Right. <laughs> community matters. We'll see if uh, these are respawned. Oh, I don't know if they no. will. Uh, oh, yep, the drag is. Oh, well. The old ones are. I'll, I'll redo mine, too. Oh, it's just the one. Yeah, all we have is the one, huh? <clears throat> oh, there we go. We got chanter buffs that's nice i feel who who more charismatic right now look like he was wielding an axe their fate does he have it on him yeah just a tarnished axe yeah Oh, wait, the just gonna kill, kill oh, nice. Good job. Good job. What was that? Oh, you interrupt it? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Tolmar. Nice. How's it going, man? Hello, welcome. Martin. Welcome, welcome. I, uh, my family will be here this weekend. Nice. And, uh, so I'll be sneaking in to play when I can <laughs> the new season. We'll see how it is <laughs> yeah we're having family dinner on sunday and uh i'm gonna be busy all day with chores so i'm gonna have to find so some if anyone stuff. wants to play really early or really late that's when i can that's when i can play so if I, you're in australia i'll play with you i will ping you at 6 a.m okay like, hey. yeah i get both of them oh boy i'll Got see you fire thanks for stopping by man i really appreciate it it's great to uh, yeah it's great to be able to to chat with you and share our thoughts and not that we don't talk enough but you know <laughs> pressure plate going he's dead he's dead yeah thanks fire i i know I, I give you a hard time but i really appreciate you uh you know doing all this stuff and and just being on all the streams man i think it's been a boon for the community just to have 
to see you and, and other other devs too but just stopping by a lot so it's really cool checking in with folks yeah it is cool yeah oh, oh ouch. explosive did not call that out sorry <laughs> I, I saw it way too late Funny. I feel like compared to last Thursday when we were doing the spiders, I'm much more like I'm being very lackadaisical with my abilities. I'm not. I'm not playing yeah, optimally well, for sure. We're not fighting as nearly as difficult stuff, so yeah, there's <laughs> no need for it, right? We're just kind of running around. There's the a boar oh. out here trying to give me the business, so <laughs> you know. He's looking at you funny. Yeah. It's a really loud, like, elk call when I came out of the game. <laughs> it's, like, really loud. Yeah, <laughs> Mr. C. No rest. No rest for Dez. No, that's fine. No fire, fire is pretty tree. involved, and I, I, I do appreciate it. Fire bad, tree pretty. <laughs> <laughs> so it sounds like a health thing to say. Do you mean fire from VR? Or fire it bad. Set, or it no, also. No. Yeah. <laughs> Just a simple buff. Just when you think you're fighting and you aren't, you're not swinging a darn thing. Swing that darn thing. Put that thing back where it came from. <laughs> or so help me. Walnut. Uh, this is one of my Walnut. favorite spots in the game for lighting when the sun goes down like this. Like, I really think it looks, yeah. it looks great up here because of the elevation. Yeah. Yep. I've had a couple really good, what? like, fog, dusk, dawn. Although, uh, times. Mm -hmm. I do kind of mm -hmm. wish the sun was making the clouds into sunset colors. Oh, crow. Mm -hmm. You and your There's wild. a little bit of lighting change, but... Yeah. Some temperature changes? Maybe, uh, maybe they've adjusted that with the um, lighting update. Who knows? So they definitely have the capability in HDRP, that's for sure. Yep, I've heard it can make inanimate <laughs> mannequins into beautiful <laughs> ladies. I love that you brought up that video. I, like that you... I, forgot yeah. about, I forgot about that video. That was great. I forgot about it. It's, it's one of your I was best. like, oh my gosh, uh, how stupid I forgot. Like, I actually made that. Yep. We're not getting the bear? I, I was going to run towards it. The, the other bear was just... Oh, it was further away than I thought it was. Don't tell uh, Barrow or Vin, but Cleric is the best healer. <laughs> so, feel so powerful. Regretfully, these yeah, just so many. I want Druid. Yeah, but you don't get a wolf pet at ten. It's true. She'll take that. <laughs> She'll I don't get Druid to my pull fox. things from. Oh, Herode. You can't fill your entire bar with dots That's and. True. <laughs> Yeah, you did some uh, you did some pretty extreme climbing there. I saw Man Rohan. You had like all yeah, man. like five wind strider buffs here. and yeah, yeah I you climbed got up there right behind us that tower. I went up all the way up there. And and so when you get up there, can you go to the tower? Like how far? Can no, you go? there's a wall. Um, yeah, right where I took the picture, there was a wall. So I, see. I was hoping, but yeah, you get... before there was a wall up there, I I think I probably have some shots of going up to the tower. It's just you know it's just an asset. Yeah. This unfortunately. Well, I mean, I started See, at the very bottom. Now the clouds bottom. are changing color. That's nice. Mm hmm Yeah. Yeah. See, look at that. Looks good. Yeah, pretty. You and your unfounded accusations. Well, grow. the sun was still pretty low to the horizon when it hadn't changed, so. Yeah. The, yeah. the color change could come a little bit sooner. Yeah. Yep. It's not unfounded, but, man. 
Yeah, it'll be it'll if be we're stars being nitpicked. At 6 o'clock, yeah. so. <laughs> I'm like, just build the world, and you guys. I want the color on the clouds to be a little more subtle. <laughs> like, Oops. I gotta like, yeah. I mean, that was one of the things from the Q and A that kind of like when when Joppa said, "Yeah, we haven't built any of uh, the other continents at all." <laughs> I'm like. Uh, I was so glad they confirmed that. I mean, you know, I've been saying that for so I think long. They should release it, with King's Reach. Seriously. Mm, no. Yeah. Nope. 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 How will I be a dwarf? Yeah. How? What? What? What about Amber Fate? <laughs> what about all these places? Well, Amber Fate's on King's Reach, right? No. Isn't it? No, it's nope. on the southern continent. So is there's it? King's oh, Reach, Fate. Yeah, that's Rainfall the... is the western one, and then the southern one is... Well, I mean, but if you release a game with a monthly fee, and King's Reach gives us three starting areas, and maybe some camps for other races here and there, then that gives them a source of income to continue expanding the world. Is it White Thought? The other White one? Thought, yeah. I, yeah. Thank I, you I was you. thinking about yeah. um, Fairthale when you said Amber Fate. Yeah. Fairfield is in. It is. Yeah. yeah. I mean, as an archive, I would love, I would love my home of Suroa, uh, but at the same time, I do think King's Reach is big enough, landmass-wise, to support content one to fifty. Yeah. And I think the goal was always to have it support content one to fifty. Not Just, always. You know, there was. There might be a little more crowding. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure if that was always the plan, but I, I like what I would say is I think it's probably likely that that's what ends up happening. Do I think that's what should end up happening? No, but I think they need, I mean, if it, that's it, what'll get them a full leveling experience and a source of income, so they can keep making the game. Sounds like a good idea to me. Right. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. You need. Um, you need a. A vast world to entice pe people. Well, I was thinking about like when he says built it at all. I'm like, well, you did have Amber Fate at some point, so and they you mean rebuilt? Yeah, it would be rebuilding Amber yeah. Fate completely because yeah, obviously, the obviously current... they don't have it anymore. I mean, we all knew that anyway. It's just sort of a yeah. reminder. But, uh, yeah, Fairthale's what I'm really looking forward to. Yeah, and I mean, I would imagine Fairthale's in the same boat. You know, it needs to be completely rebuilt. Yep. The funny thing is too is you look back on some of the like some of the first ever content they ever put out you can actually see like parts of rainfall like kaga sands they showed off some some areas yeah in, yeah in that area which is like the only time that's ever been shown and that was like whatever 10 years ago but um yeah i just i feel like there needs to be a vast world that you like you wonder about what's on the other side of the world and i mean that to me that inspires people to but I, I practically, I, you guys, I mean, you're right. You're absolutely right, practically. Yeah, I mean, if it was on the table, you know, one continent or three, I would want three. But <laughs> yeah. like, but if it's three times as long, uh, <laughs> I'd rather have it now. Yeah. Just realistically. Yeah, I, th I think we've reached the capacity of where we're Can grinding. Can we access? Just... FYI. King's Reach early access. <laughs> well. Yeah, it's not uh, not really a good place to go. Maybe some place in AVP. I don't know. Yeah, we can go over and check out the bandits, um, the Gadai camps in AVP if you guys want. Be okay with that. Sure. We could switch it up. Sure. That sounds good. Who knows? Maybe uh, uh, Shane was lying. Like I said, <laughs> we can just head to the spiders. Shane was pulling. I mean, we could we could pat. I mean, if we're going that way already, right? Yeah, now, just so head we right could, by We them. could check. Might as well. And forever, he will be known as. I'm just kidding. <laughs> we'll be nice to Chang. <laughs> We're coming for you, Chang. He just answered a question. It's not like he did anything. <laughs> Is it camp? Yes. Daddy hates you. <laughs> oh, very dear. Yeah. 
I mean, some people are odd and eat two hot dogs in one bun. And I say that that's crazy. That's called a double dog, and it's a delicacy. Uh, <laughs> no. What? Who that's for the that? rich kids. Oh, my God. I'd say that's... Uh, that, that is the, the average, ratio, like the ratio of meat the, to bread is ridiculous. Like that's, you yeah, that's can't. terrible. No, that's, that's exactly right, man. The ratio right, of a typical hot dogs no, meat uh, to bread is what are you, ridiculous. Insane. You got a perfect bun to meat ratio with one hot dog. Throw another one in there. Throw another one in there. Now you got all way too much meat in your mouth. You don't want that. Dude. I mean, <laughs> I yes, expect I, this from Theric, oh, I got a good eye band on me. Desert. <laughs> hey now yeah, I, I was supporting you now wait a minute I thought we were on the same team here what, what no we are I'm saying I I could expect some weirdness about hot dogs from <laughs> it was all meant to be against desert so sorry <laughs> okay. I, I, I'll, I'll accept I my oh. foot right in my mouth <laughs> oh, please, we're fighting both you put that hot dog really right in your mouth there uh, we could also go actually if we don't want to go all the way into AVP, we could go to the goblins on on the the overlook that I was talking about earlier. Oh right, right. Wow. Uh, we could try it. Sure. We could try it. Yeah, I haven't been in the in the goblin caves for a long time. Yeah, be any dark, darker than. We're probably this. gonna want wind strider yeah. though. <laughs> for make our escapes. We're not going to the go the goblin caves. Oh. Right. Well, right. What were you suggesting? Um. The, the plateau yeah, above the plateau, the goblin. where the orcs used to be. Oh, oh I remember. yes. Yeah. yeah, I'm down for that. Lead on. I haven't been there in forever either. Oh. Oh. Tough. oh. Yeah, it'll be a Random. bit tough. We might die. I don't know. I could go for some challenge. <laughs> All right. There's someone yes. down there. Oh, Chang. Chang, if you're watching, I believe you. You weren't lying. I had to tech... tech Check it out. Can't say words. That's Jason has Let's it right. Listen to this. It. Two dogs in one bun, and you run the risk of ripping the bun and making it into a sandwich. Yes. You're going right. Yes, absolutely. Get a better bun. I, mean, I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> what? And what? Sandwiches. And if you no, they're not a sandwich. Who's what? Morning or whatever, like my son does. <laughs> A hot dog is a sandwich. A hot you dog is call it a sandwich. Just like a square is a rectangle, but you never call it a rectangle. Okay, you are insane. You, you have officially <laughs> you've spit the bit. Pete. You've you're yeah, off the rails. Get out of here. <laughs> I don't know get what there, here. what you're talking about. A hot dog is not I'm a sandwich. Still getting used to calling subs grinders in the north. Grinders. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Hoggies and grinders. Hoggies and grinders. <laughs> Look at all the people chiming in in chat. We've we've opened up a whole uh, can of worms here about the rot the hot dog debate. Um, it, all right. It's meat between <laughs> bread. It's already a sandwich. But yeah, but, but, but yeah, yeah. A sandwich by its nature. Yeah. Um, is a is is. We got a great howler. Like, I don't know how to describe this to you. It seems obvious. It's like calling chili a soup. Right, exactly. It is Thank a, you. It's a stew. It is. Oh it's lord, a stew. Oh lord, chili is not a All stew. Right. Okay, <laughs> you mania. Chili is chili. It's, the, it's the what technicalities. <laughs> listen, chili listen. That doesn't make it not chili beans. or not a hot dog. But exactly, it could be under F these other both. categories. But uh, so, it, speaking of zip, though, <laughs> sorry, zip. he just happens to be running with us. Right so now. what you're saying is a hot dog is a category of sandwich, and chili is a category of stew. No. Yes. No. You are yes. Right. No. 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 Absolutely oh not. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is blasphemy. It can be both. Blast me. We need to get Ziplocs in here. He, he would know. Having taxonomy yeah. problems again. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> exactly. That's food, our food taxonomy. More taxonomy problems. <laughs> Who knew there were so do, many? Do we want to? Do we want to try going in the back of the cave? Yeah. Since we're like, heck here. Yes. Sure. Let's do it. I mean, I've never like, been in there. Let's do it. You've never been in. Oh my no, gosh. Look, I have well, not stepped I don't think, one foot in this. I don't think we could get like super far, oh, but you're going I'm just way. thinking you're about like. In the water. Okay. Okay. Hold on. Hold we on. We just happen to be here. So. If no penalty on death. So let's do it. Ziplocs true, true. is a master chef. And he just said. Chili is, Chili its, is own its own thing. thing. All right. Mm -hmm. End of end of argument. <laughs> Hold on, Wait. I, I got to put poison on my daggers. One, one Where side. did he say that? He's standing next to us. He said it's in chat. like. No. Uh, oh, he's in yeah. game. He said yeah. in game. Yeah, it's in game. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> what a world! You got to pay what attention. Is, what is what is white bean soup then? Huh? Is white bean soup chili or is it soup? <laughs> 
white well, bean soup is so obscure that nobody knows the answer to that question. It's very, it's no, it's like white white bean soup with like ham and stuff. It's very normal. So how about this? It's, that's not chili, but what it's a, the same thing. It's just white. So if you if you have a chili dog, are you putting stew on a sandwich? Said, Do you put okay, stew any other stew on any other sandwich? No, you don't. <laughs> in, in Texas, isn't chili just an all meat thing, or am I confused? Yeah, they don't do beans. Yeah, that's yeah. what I was thinking. Oh, zip is a no beans in. Okay. Yeah, yeah, that explains that, that, that explains it. Thing. Well, the the Texas style chili is more of a sauce than a, than a stew. I was not aware of that. Here's our first skitter thing. A chili dog is a sloppy Joe. Okay, Mr. C, you're kind of you're kind of getting me there uh, again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, a chili dog is a sloppy Joe. I'll go for that. Yeah, I kind of agree with that, but because. That seems to make sense. Beans right, we are, are getting into traditional group content, Mexican, by the way. Mexican chili. <laughs> chalupa. Which is a stew. Jason says it's chalupa. I like that. Chalupa. Chalupa. Remember yeah, the chalupa from... Uh, yeah. I Yes? Chalupas were good, man. Yeah, delicious. Actually, pretty good. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, these things are like running immediately. Do you have oh, come on, yet? Bad. I do, I do. Oh. I just didn't put it. Oh, oh. nothing. Wait, who dinged? I'm a ding. I need to learn a spell here. Hang on. Okay. Okay. Nice. Congrats. Uh, let me make sure I got my stuff going here. Yeah. Well, good. the spiders at least are like right yeah. in line with. So we just need to be careful, but this might actually be decent. Okay. I'll get, I'll get on the caltrops. Pick up my caltrop game. That sounds <clears> painful. <throat> <laughs> no. yeah. Not literally. I'll get on the. Yeah, the, the the first half of the stream just running around killing solo mobs, you know, having a good time. The but, enchanter uh, isn't doing. That. Now, now we all have jobs to do. <laughs> We're getting real. <laughs> Ziploc says he sold his lantern, so he's testing for season two already. <laughs> <laughs> so just FYI, Zip, you can buy a, a a replacement lantern pelt if you need it. But I had to remember. To but buy. also. Since they're taking them away, I'm selling chain belts for uh, oh. ten silver. Yeah, I'm gonna really, I'm gonna get you. Everything must go. Fire sale. I'm not actually selling them. No. Why can't I attack? Ooh. Yeah, dark, dark blue group moms. Uh oh, I think I'm lagging. This is pretty good. Oh, yeah, okay. we, we yeah. don't have to go too far in. We can do. There's like a spot where where the gut goes down, and there's some goblins down there. We can kill spiders and goblins. I think I'm lagging. Hold on. Uh, okay. Uh, uh, Not again. Okay. Eric's been replaced by a robot. I can hear him typing. Yeah, <laughs> uh, yeah he, he put it in. Oh, the, no, that was Stan. Yeah. Alas, poor Eric. I knew right, well, it looks, it looks like this. Oh, my stream isn't even oh. on live. Eric. Uh, and there you go. Oh, disconnect. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, last time it cleared up pretty quick, so. I mean, I can see uh, Theric like his camera, but it looks like the uh, other cams are frozen. <laughs> he waved at us. Sounds like uh, some sort of um, um, crap. What's it? What's the German electronic band? Kraftwerk. Yeah, that's one. One of Kraftwerk, the uh, German band. Nah, I mean one that I'm most familiar with. I should say they were, you know, around like that. I think. Ah, uh, the.
12 is also really good. I think it, it, it got a lot of hate at the time that it came out, but 12 is, is looking back on it, 12 is, is really, really good. files there, the, you know, the, the content libraries. And so now I'm learning basic Logic Pro setup for efficient use of memory and everything. And mm -hmm. then I can try and load the MIDI files that I saved from Studio One and see what work needs to. And that was, yeah, I think but... I mentioned that I, I felt like listening to my old tunes that they could use some improvement so what I want to do first for Logic Pro is just go back and redo some of the stuff I've already written and mm -hmm. use the knowledge I've gained over the last year yeah Logic is what I really got started on um, and I think it it's a really great DAW as far as like yeah. Very easy to use, but also, it, so. yeah. Yeah, I I was debating between Logic and Ableton when I ended up buying Ableton. I and I mostly did because I'm much more familiar with PCs than Macs, so I'm like, yeah, I'll just do something that can just be on both. So that was my problem with Logic. Is that yeah, yeah, that was I, I understand same. that feeling, but I was since I was looking into getting a separate composition computer anyway that wasn't an issue and studio one there are things about the interface i really don't like and i bounced off cubase pretty hard too yeah i mean really i don't know some people the people who i know who use it love it but i'm like i don't know anyone else who was oh boy <laughs> oh no <laughs> No, yeah. turn off the auto attack. I can't. I'm still getting blasted <laughs> by it. I always, I always, uh, oh gosh, you just put it back on too. I always hit escape, but it doesn't turn, turn off your auto attack. And you'll just start attacking again. Yeah, I, <laughs> it, it's unfortunate because it, either there's a delay or I, you get hit by other people's attacks too. Cause like I hit tilt, my yeah, auto attack sorry, turned off after one. I got up. But oh, what the? Oh. I'll bring you back up to sec. But you have a kind mana. This is really when we need emotes. I want to be able to slash mourn. <laughs> yeah, that's definitely high priority there. Oh no. I just read about Theric. Oh, yeah. no. Read about what? He has to... His internet is just too gone. Oh. Yeah, this has been happening 